Okie dokie, second example for this problem. If you'd like more of a breakdown, please visit the other example I've worked out. I will kind of do this one a little bit faster. So we are given this function f of x, and the goal is to identify where it's increasing and decreasing. So let's start with option A. They say only increasing over the interval 2 to 5. So between 2 and 5, we are analyzing whether it's increasing or decreasing. So it appears to be increasing because the y values are going up from left to right over that interval. All right, second one, from 8 to 9, they claim it's increasing. From 8 to 9, increasing appears to be true. So that checks out. Number three, only increasing from 7 to 8. From 7 to 8, it actually starts off decreasing. So that statement cannot be true. So it makes the entire statement false. Option B, increasing over 6 to 7. 6 to 7 is clearly decreasing the whole time, so that statement is false, which makes B entirely negligible. Jumping to C, they say it's only increasing from 2 to 5. We claim that was true in option A, so that still checks out. Only increasing 8 to 9, I think that was also true in option A, so that checks out. And then they say both increasing and decreasing over 5 to 6. Let's investigate. Between 5 and 6, it starts off increasing, and then it changes to decreasing just before 6. So that statement is true. So that, uh, that makes C our best choice here. Break out the eraser and see that C is, in fact, our answer. All right.